Today we're going to take a look at the difference between Peplink's Speed Fusion routers versus typical failover routers. For our demonstration we have a Pepwave Speed Fusion enabled router on the left hand of the screen and on the right side, we have a typical failover router. Each router has its own wired internet connection along with a cellular modem as a secondary connection. The blue wire running into each router is our wired WAN, whereas the cellular connections are built in. Each router has a wired connection to a laptop. That laptop is how we are connected to our online meeting. Now at this point in the video we could talk in bullet points about how Speed Fusion Hot Failover provides you with an always-on connection, whereas a standard failover interrupts that connection. I think it is more impactful to show you the difference via a live demonstration. With both networks connected to the same meeting, our presenter will start the meeting. This is a standard meeting where we have web pages up, a slide, and a video that's going to run in the background. Now the video is going to start, and you can see that both networks are running the exact same meeting. But what happens in a worst-case scenario where you lose internet connectivity during that important meeting? Well, let's go ahead and find out. For those of you without Speed Fusion, do not try this at home. Immediately you'll notice the typical failover router has failed. The presentation is no longer active on the laptop on the right. This is because as the wired internet connection switches over to cellular, all the sessions are dropped and the connection is lost. Now imagine the exact same event if you were on a voice over IP call, processing a credit card transaction, or accessing vital documents and services. The whole time, the router on the left has continued on, completely uninterrupted. Demonstrating the exact difference between always-on connectivity with speed fusion and typical failover routers.